beautiful find by Kenesha Bell. Kenesha Bell is just putting on a clinic right now. She is the absolute MVP of this team, in my opinion. This is a player who can flat out score. That was Kenesha Bell, and the Golden Gophers put on a clinic yesterday, 101-68 win over Penn State today. Now they're in sole possession of fourth place in the Big Ten. Moving on up, Kenesha, welcome to the Women's Sports Report. Now after yesterday's game, Coach Stallings very happy with that 33 points you guys scored in the first quarter, but what she said was humongous. You held Penn State to just eight points in that second quarter. Tell me, how has your defense progressed over the course of this season? Oh, man, our defense has been tremendous. We're playing against teams who are, they have a lot of drivers on their team. They have people who can score. They have an all-around team, and it's pretty intense for us because um, we always been told that, you know, they could be so much better if the defense was there. And I think this year we've been making a statement on defense and stopping teams um, from scoring as much as they usually do. Coach Stallings also said that this is a very fun team to coach. It's one of the most special teams she has ever coached. So as a player, just what makes this team special? And maybe it is just that bond that you were describing. Um, we gotta we play up tempo. Like we run and push the ball no matter what. And it's hard for other teams to keep up with that pace when we going a hundred miles per hour throughout the whole game. It's like nonstop. And it's it's that's really fun to play with and hard for people to guard that. And speaking of special, you have a special freshman, Destiny Pitts. She was named Freshman of the Week for her sixth time this season. What kind of impact is she having on this team? Just the f fact that we can have someone come in as a freshman and be smart and mature on the court, um, enough to even trust her on the court and doing things. You know, sometimes you have um, her make freshman mistakes, but it's rare. And I think that's like the maturity part that um, Destiny Pitts has uh, has with our team. Even just your reaction said it all, like when I mentioned her name. Now, a challenging week for you guys. Michigan Wednesday, followed by Maryland on Sunday. So what kind of preparation goes into a week like this? Um, I think that since we've been playing so well, we don't really have too much to worry about. I think that it's just another game where we can play our best and see the outcome of the game. I think that we are a better team this year, so I, I'm looking forward to these two games. It's going to be hard, but it's going to be a good win for us if we get these. And last question, we were talking about this earlier. I have to ask you, you have nine brothers and seven sisters. What was it like growing up in your household? You said you have to bus it everywhere. Family reunions are crazy. <laughs> Yes, um, our family reunions. We have to get in a van just to go to um, <laughs> just to go to family events and stuff like that. I think that is actually more fun because you growing up around so many kids, you know how to share. You know, you learn the basics playing with um, people that you already grew up with and stuff like that. It's so much easier to get along with people outside of um, just family as well, just because you know how to treat each other and stuff early. Mind you, some some of the kids that's like the only kid, it's kind of hard to raise them just because you, they so used to being spoiled and stuff like that. I think my mom talked about that a lot. She's like, well, you better be lucky you got so many siblings so that you can <laughs> learn how to treat them and things like that. So I, I just think it's fun to grow up with a lot of people around your age because you know, it's never a dull moment with none of them. You were saying you also have two basketball teams there that you guys can feed. Thank you so much, Kanisha, for your time. Appreciate it. Thank you.